Hi, I'm Stuart and welcome to Sona Television. We take a look at something that the guys and gals in the uh, setup shop have been working on. They created this really nice uh, setup to allow us to display the new Vertex light heads, which are in from Wheelan Engineering in the great state of Chester, Connecticut, which by the way were a great hit at the IACP. But basically what we have in here are a variety of different colors of Vertex LED hideaways. All the technical information is available on the website, you can check out that. But I'm going to just turn on and show you what it would look like in a taillight assembly and a corner module assembly. And this is something that we are using in our display area in our main showroom here at Sirenet.com. So let's just take a quick look at some of the options that you have here. Uh, this little switch here allows me to turn on what would normally be the corner marking light. So you get a chance to see what the clear LED or white LED would look like in relation to the fact that the cornering module was on. I can, with the flick of a switch, change the flash patterns. Um, of course, you could probably do it in the car if you wanted to, but uh, might drive the chief crazy. But anyway, again, find the particular pattern that you like, and then you can set up that pattern and it will stay put. You, of course, you can also synchronize them as well. That's something worth noting. In this particular light, we also have a red. So we have a red and white in there. Now again, um, let's turn off the white for a second, leave the red on, you get an idea of what that looks like. Turn off the corner module, and you can see that undoubtedly white gives that high impact punch uh, as opposed to the red. It is nice and bright. And again, we can change the, uh, the flash pattern, the flicking of a switch here. There's different multitude of ones. All the technical specifications are on the website, including the number of different flash patterns that you can go through. So find a pattern that suits your needs and you can leave it locked in position. So there we have it there. This is a corner module. You just saw the red, the white, and also with some background lighting on as well. So if you're fortunate enough to have red and white options, there you go. You can mix and match with red and white. The next thing we're going to take a look at here is on the taillight assembly. And in this particular application here, we have a white LED. That's what's actually going on inside here. And then we have a colored LED in the lower area. And then we have an additional white LED on the lower level. A couple of things to note. You can put red LEDs behind a red taillight if you wish but you can't put any other color behind there other than white. So red and white will be acceptable here. And of course, you can put in any other color configuration you want in the white area, i.e. clear, if you wish to do that. So let's just turn on some switches here. And right now, I've just turned on, this happens to be a blue one, and you can see blue firing away there. If you wanted to, you could put on a clear LED, if that's a, something that takes your fancy. This, of course, is the backup light, nice and bright there. And again, I can change the flash pattern. You can find the flash pattern that you want in relation to this. So multitudes of flash patterns, a really great product to play around with. And uh, currently priced pretty darn good, I might add. So let's take a look at some of the other colors. This one happens to be red, firing that away. And let's turn on the lower level one. They're both red LEDs. Again, white would work in here just as good. And you can pick the flash pattern that suits your, your needs or application. So I'll just turn on. The background lighting, just an idea there with some background lighting on, you can see what that looks like. Of course, if a brake light comes on, that will affect it. And turn that off, and you can see what it looks like accordingly. So again, great products from all of us here at Sirenet.com, and great products from the folks over there at Wheelan Engineering in Chester, Connecticut. I'll say a big hi to Brian and to Keith. They took care of me really well at IACP. So again, Thanks for watching Sarnet. I'm Stuart. Enjoy.